Hey, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up to everybody out there on YouTube on this lovely Sunday evening. And as always, welcome to Super Hubby Review. I uh, thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to drop by my channel. It is much appreciated. Again, uh, I hope all of you and your families are safe out there. I hope you enjoy football weekend in college and the NFL. Hope your favorite team won. And um, again, I made this channel because I love giving my review on various products that I purchased for myself or my family. And, and I made these, these videos in the hopes that something positive would be said to that would uh, make a positive impact in your purchases for yourself or your family. And since you're here, I also thank you in advance for subscribing to my channel. Um, really would love to have you guys be a part of this. Everybody's welcome to subscribe. Everyone from all walks of life, I welcome you to this channel. It is much appreciated. Okay, let's go ahead and get into it. Today, I am going to be reviewing this. Uh, I'm going to be reviewing this Hot Point um, deep freezer that we purchased from, I believe it was Lowe's. Um, I believe the cost price was under $300, so I will put the exact cost price in the description of this content, but I do believe it was under right at $300, could be a little bit more or less, but somewhere around that ballpark at the, the time that we purchased it, it might be a little bit less uh, now. So um, I am very pleased with this deep freezer. This was the size that me and my wife uh, decided that would be perfect for our family to store up some extra food, uh, particularly with all of the food shortages that, that are happening. Unfortunately, COVID has been very tough on a lot of us and it really hasn't been easy and I'll be glad and I hope and pray this thing hurry up and goes away so we can get back to normal. But I'm very pleased with this and I'm going to show you, um, basically, the, this is just a basic, a casual re review of the, show you a few uh, things about it. It stores a good little amount of food. I, very, I was very impressed with how much you can get in this little deep freezer here. Um, it comes in a huge box, so you want to make sure that you got someone to help you um, carry this into the house. Uh, be extremely safe, uh, you and your children, because this thing is kind of heavy um, if you're not you know if you're not really a physical person so have someone help you carry this into the house um so basically you pretty much i mean there's really nothing to really install on it comes with a basket and uh just plug it up and you're ready to go uh or whatever you do have to like uh you know melt all the ice in it maybe a couple of months or so every other month kind of melt it out make sure the uh nothing's in there and kind of wipe it down a little bit and clean it out but i'm gonna show you and give you a close-up view of this kind of show you the every angle of it what you're working with here nice little size little size i'm gonna give you a shot from that angle and we're gonna come here and show you the other side. Very pleased with, I'm very pleased, very pleased with this deep freezer here. Extremely pleased with it. And there's nothing like um, making a purchase and you're happy with your purchase. All right, on to the best part. Uh, I just went to the grocery store, just stocked up, very blessed and fortunate to be able to do that. And as you can see, this thing holds a lot of items. It is just packed with food. I mean, look at all that stuff in there, y'all. It's just so much stuff. Everybody's favorite food is in here. And it is just, see, so much you can get. It's so much that you can get in this little deep freezer here. I mean, you can really get a lot up in here, y'all. I mean, a lot. So much. There's like food at the very bottom of it. I mean, it's like just everything. So if you're curious about Will everything fit? Yes, you can get, you can get a lot in here. Um, it is five of us, five of us in my residence, me and my wife and two old, two young adult children and my young, my youngest daughter. So we, we try to keep a, a lot of food, different things that everybody likes and keep it full to capacity. 
the way it looks right now, I guarantee you, in a few, about a week and a half, all of this is probably going to be all gone. Except for Hot Pockets. That always is the last remaining food item. Nobody likes Hot Pockets, but oh well. Whatever, we'll figure it out. But I'm going to hold so much. I normally do, I normally do all of this. And by the way, since you're here, these are delicious. You got to get these. These are like a copycat, uh, copycat version of of uh, Chick Fil A nuggets. I, I know that this is about a deep freezer, but if you if you can, you got to go out and get these. These little uh, like knockoff, uh, a knockoff version of Chick Fil A um, chick chicken bites. But of course, these are by members. Mark, shout out to Sam's Club for having these available. Figured I'd just slide that in there. So yeah, um, it holds a lot. So if you're wondering, hmm, is it gonna hold a lot? Now I wish I would have got one a little bit bigger, but this one does it. I mean, this one does it. This this is a good purchase. Good purchase. I'm very pleased with it. You're definitely gonna be able to stock a lot of food items in this. So don't worry about that. Um, I'm just very strategic in how I sh stock it up and put food in there. You definitely want to make sure that you are very strategic in putting your food items in here so you can get maximize the space given to you. Uh, just putting stuff in there, just sloppy and unorganized. You're probably not going to be able to maximize the full potential. It's almost like a puzzle and I won't let anyone stock it up but me. I'm very anal about things being neat, everything being perfect, and I try to put things in here that everybody likes. I know what everybody likes, and I want to put it according to everybody's preference, so it's like a puzzle to me. I love doing this, this stuff, and that's why you know I call myself Super Hubby. I do it all. I do it all. Uh, there's a little drain here that you can kind of pull off this little thing here. Sorry for that camera. This little thing here, when you're draining it, it can, a little drain. A knob that the water can come out, but it, it doesn't hold much ice. I mean, I just norm normally get a clean towel and just wipe out all the ice. Here is the um, let me adjust this camera here, get you a better look. Mm, right there, here is the little temperature. Here, we normally keep it on about between six, six and a half. It, it, you know, it definitely does, does, it does a job. It's a cute little, nice little, little efficient deep freezer that serves its purpose. This here, this is this little thing here, doesn't even do anything. I guess it's just there for show, sure. but the only thing that matters is the the, um, the temp, you know, the uh, cold frequency knob here or in the drain. Just plug it up, wipe it down, and you're good to go. So, those are pretty much my thoughts on this deep freezer. I'll just show you again before I close this review out. So yeah, these are my thoughts. So if you've seen this in Lowe's and you've wondered, is it spacious enough? Yes, it is spacious. Go out and get it for your family to stock up if you can. Unfortunately, these food shortages have been kind of a concern um, for me and my family, but you know, we gotta have faith and stay close to our families and fight through it and just kind of figure it out. But you definitely wanna stock up if you can. Shout out to Hot Point for making a pretty good deep freezer. Again, thank you guys so much for dropping by Super Hubby Review. I will continue to put up reviews in my spare moments. And uh, I hope that something positive was said or mentioned that would uh, make an impact in your buying decisions. And I also uh, feel free to comment below any questions you may have for those of you who have purchased this, not only is it important for me to share my thoughts, but I'm also curious to know what are your thoughts? What are the pros and the cons? I actually don't have any complaints about this deep freezer. Surprisingly, I have no complaints. And I also thank you in advance for subscribing to my channel. I'm doing something positive for the community and, uh, you know, create some positive content that you can enjoy for yourself and your family. So until next time, be safe out there. Enjoy your night and goodbye.